there's been a ton written about whether or not it's important to have multi-tenancy in SAS. And there's a lot of controversy on this topic. But one thing that I've noticed is that the discussion seems to overlook two important use cases that are just critical to the business value of SAS. Aggregation and inheritance. And I, I want to talk about what they are and why we really need to have them and how uh, how elegantly they can be delivered if we have a true SaaS environment. But I also think it's fair to say that both of them can be mimicked with enough code. So this is one of those situations where we really have to go deep to understand not just what functionality is being delivered, but how it's being delivered. Aggregation is the capability that allows a vendor to collect data across all of their tenants Crowdsourcing is another term for it, and that data can be used, again, with the permission of the tenants for many useful purposes. It might simply help the vendor to understand how their software is being used and therefore be able to put more of their resources into the things the customers really need. But even more important than aggregation, in my opinion, is inheritance. And this is the ability for the vendor to establish one set of something, one set of metadata, one set of business rules, one set of regulatory reports, one set of something. Manage it once, test it once, ensure that it's absolutely correct, and then have that same capability inherited by each of the tenants operating within that environment. But it goes further than that because it allows a single tenant, a single customer to set up I don't know, a comp plan that they're going to use in their U.S. sales operations. And at the end of the year, when they see that it really, really worked well, and they want to unleash that comp plan across the entire organization, they can do it. It's a matter of changing the effective date. This was effective for this division, for this time period, and now it's effective across the entire company for this time period. Ah! effective dating, inheritance, working together. When aggregation and inheritance are used together, one of the most powerful things happens. So aggregation allows, through crowdsourcing, individual tenants to submit. It could be a report, it could be a custom object, it could be some insight that they've had. And again, with their permission, it can then be shared, inherited by everyone else. This magnifies the power of being a part of a SaaS community. And in the end, it's that power that really matters to the customer. So these are very powerful capabilities. I don't see how they can be done elegantly without multi-tenancy. I'm waiting for someone to tell me. Thank you.